Welcome to Primary Weapon Training. You've just received supplies. You and your team will be awarded these supplies for completing objectives or defending our weapon caches. Make sure to always know what your team's current goal is. If you fulfill this goal, you will get more supplies to continue fighting. We get paid to do a job. We have contracts, specific tasks, and expectations that we need to meet. Always pay attention to the briefing, and you'll be rewarded properly. Now, grab a primary weapon from the weapon cache with the supplies you just received. This is a standard issue primary weapon. Depending on your role in the field, you'll have different primary weapons available to you. For example, if you're a marksman, you'll have access to different high caliber battle rifles. If you're a support, you'll probably be carrying an LMG. You get the idea. Eliminate all those targets through the plywood. Get acquainted with your primary. Now, keep in mind, different weapon calibers will penetrate different materials. Being in concealment is not the same as being in cover, and that goes for the enemy as well. Be mindful of how thick your cover is and what weapons are being fired at you. Now, follow me. Let's talk about your gear, weapon modifications and attachments. You've just been given additional supplies. You can now you can purchase some attachments for your primary weapon or your sidearm. Regular weapon attachments include aim assists, like scopes for long-range engagements and non-magnifying sights for close to medium-range engagements. Other attachments will affect your recoil and handling, like the foregrip, which will decrease your recoil. You also have the option for a heavy barrel for long-range engagements, which will stabilize your aim. Other than those, you can find your suppressors, which will muffle your shots and hide your muzzle flash. You also have a laser sight to help you aim. It can be difficult to land your shots if you're not aiming down your sights. Having a pointer that tells you where your rod will hit helps with that. It has decent range, just don't blind your buddies with it. And finally, you've got your flashlight attachment. I'm not gonna lecture on that one, it's pretty clear what it does. Try out a few attachments on those targets over there. Take your time. Just, just, just get familiar with them and meet me in the warehouse when you're done. Hey! You see the wrecked car? That's a control point! You and your team will be required to capture strategic CPs in the area of operation. You need to make sure the control point is clear before you capture it. It is important to secure the perimeter around the CP. Go and capture the car. Good. Now make your way to the next waypoint, clearing the warehouse as you go. Eliminate all the targets. I'll see you outside. Well done. I'm outside. Come see me. All right, we're gonna talk about long-range engagements. But before we do that, let's make use of that flashlight attachment of yours. If you don't have one, go ahead and resupply from the weapon cache over there. If you don't have enough supplies for it, you could trade some of your current equipment to get supplies. You're gonna be juggling supplies a lot. Don't be afraid to sell something important to get something more important. Now, now we've placed five portraits of a dear old friend of ours out there in the dark. You might be able to see him without it, but I recommend you use your flashlight. Take him out. Nice job. You just made the world a better place. Oh, and you know what? We actually just got some cool new toys in. We now have access to an NVG accessory. They work real well. Should be useful after nightfall. Go ahead and try them on. Be careful when you use them. 
if you look at any sources of light, when you have them on, it's gonna blind you pretty bad. And especially if a bad guy puts a flashlight at you, it's really gonna fuck with your eyes, so just be careful when you wear them. Let's talk about grenades and explosives. If you take a look at your gear, you can see that you have space for extra equipment. Depending on how many supplies you have, you'll be able to afford multiple types of grenades or explosives. And we have access to three different types of grenades. Flash grenades, smoke grenades, and fragmentation grenades. I want to see how you can throw. Do you see the dumpster behind the windows on your left? Yeah, throw a frag in there. You can resupply your grenades to the weapon cache if you run out. Nice throw. Now, you can, all, you can roll grenades on the floor if you want to, say, clear out a stairwell underneath you or something. Roll a grenade under that wooden fence. Try to get it down that hole and don't blow us up. I know I'm doing something... Oh, Jesus Christ, resupply. That's the word I was looking for. Nice, our grenade hole just got deeper. As for other explosives, we've got your standard C4 charges and RPGs. Although we don't have one of those available at the moment, so... Let's just roll with the C4 for now. C4 charges are mostly used to destroy enemy objectives, such as weapon caches. Any type of explosive will do the job, but the C4 will do it better, and it'll do it in one charge. It takes two fragmentation grenades to destroy a weapon cache. Now, you can throw C4 charges, but they're heavy, so you can't throw them far. But still, knowing your C4 reach may give you some tactical advantages in some environments. You see that dumpster behind the chain link fence to your left? Let's say there's a weapon cache in there. Throw a charge in there and blow it up. And keep in mind though, this shit isn't like in the movies, C4 blows big. Real big. Get far away, get behind something, and cover your ears. Go ahead and blow that dumpster up. Honestly, I'm not sure about which thing he talks about. Alright. 
Jesus Christ! A warning would have been nice! God damn it, my ear is ringing! Alright, that, that, that's enough explosives for now. I, I'd like to keep my hearing. Shit. Let's move on to long-range engagements and scopes. Go ahead and attach a, an LCAN scope on your primary weapon and, and take out all the targets in the field. Hey boss, uh, we got a situation developing over here. Can you come down and check it out? Damn it, I told him not to disturb me during training. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go handle this. Just go ahead and finish up with those targets. I'll be back in just a minute. Shit, you're alive! Oh, that's great news, man! Oh, what a fucking day! God damn it! I wanted to go to bed early. Well, you ought to get ready. I don't know how many are out there. Oh, shit, here they come! Yeah, we are not part of U.S. military, rather like some PNC. Stay sharp! They might be regrouping for another attack! Just keep it cool! We heard you guys were having some trouble. Need a hand? Yeah, we were. Great timing. We just finished up. Have you met this guy yet? He's tougher than he looks. Huh. Trial by fire, huh? We need more guys like that in the field. HQ has intel about who organized this raid. We're gonna head back out, finish this. Care to join us? Your call recruit. You feel ready, you can go out with them. If you wanna do some practice assignments, head back out to the firing range. Oh, and by the way, welcome to the company. Are you up for up for up?